nonverbal behavior has been seen as a powerful tool by scientists and analysts in unearthing subconscious thoughts and emotions through signals given off by humans. Modern technology now offers more pathways in determining emotions rather than relying predominantly on human analysis. In the West Bank town of Hebron, students at the Palestine Polytechnic University say they have designed a software program that can measure a person's emotions. Happiness measurement, as the program has been named, uses still images and videos to analyze and determine the degree of a person's happiness. Enes Omar and Enes Shawar developed the program and have used it on faces of their political leaders. They found out from an experiment that current President Mahmoud Abbas was happy and late President Yasser Arafat to be unhappy, according to the happiness measurement. Our final graduation project is the happiness measurement software. We use still photos and videos to measure the degree of happiness in a picture. We heard that this kind of software is being used in Berlin. The project is currently being developed to measure the age or sex of a person through videos or still pictures. Project supervisor Abdel Fattah Najjar said emotions are universal and the program aims to recognize them. The students say their software can give an idea of a person's general mood, whereas simply looking at a photo gives a basic impression of whether a person is happy or sad. Shawar said the program took three months to design and install, but now the students are seeking funding to travel and participate in international conferences in a bid to further enhance their software. Happiness measurement can be downloaded directly from the internet onto mobile phones and computers. Omar and Shawar say they are keen to expand the use of technology across Palestine. Noura Faraj, Al Arabiya.